take drinks. America runs. I'm Duncan. Product placement. Oh, <laughs> we are not getting compensated for that. <laughs> Welcome to another card opening video with Redeemed Otaku. I'm Bex, and this is Encyclo. Yay! So, um, we have a very special opening. Very special. Yeah. It's like what we've always been hoping and dreaming. I don't know about that, but <laughs> let's Maybe show them have. what we're going to be opening. We have... They probably haven't seen it in the description yet. This. Yay! Oh. Whoa. A booster set of Kamigawa. Kamikusa? Kamigawa. I don't know what the Gawa means. I know Kami is like God or spirit. In right, right. The future. In Japanese. The future is now. So I have been playing um, some of the Kamigawa content on uh, MTG Arena. Mm -hmm. And it's kind of very, very Japanese inspired, but it has a lot of other Asian influence as well. Mm -hmm. um, kind of a generic Asian thing, but, but definitely with that heavy Japanese uh, flavor. Um, and then, Asian. yeah, <laughs> generic Asian, <laughs> um, and it combines that with elements of cyberpunk. So it's a lot of fun. There's like, you know, cool, like 3d images of like, mechs. there's mechs, there's mechs, battle mm -hmm. suits. Yeah. Mm -hmm. A lot of, a lot of stuff like that. Yeah. Um, there's shrines that you can get, mm -hmm. um, and play, play different effects with the shrines. Yeah. And there's Kami. A lot of kami. Neon Dynasty. It's the Neon Dynasty. Now, isn't there a Kamigawa set that released back a few years ago? And this one is kind of like... I think this is a re-release of it, yeah. Okay. So, okay. there's going to be some cards that are familiar to some old school players. I did a little research. I'm not an old, old school player, <laughs> so it's all new to me. All right. It's all new content for me. Hooray! I'm very happy. But if you've played it in the past and you're like, oh, the old was so much better, please let us know in the comments. Yeah, definitely. Let because us know. we love trashing people who hate on good stuff. No, we won't. We won't do that. Oh. <laughs> what we'll do is we'll thumbs we'll up the comment because we'll we were so you. happy to get a comment, and then when it's just us together, we'll be like, look you, at that person. Can you believe? Can you him? believe Jesse? Oh my gosh. Oh. What a hot take that was. <laughs> bet, bet the next thing I got out of his mouth is a dad joke. Oh, boy. All right, well, I guess let's crack it open. Let's see if Jesse watches that. <laughs> <laughs> Product placement. So, here it is. Guaranteed foil and art card. As you can see, the little wizard stamps in the cool plastic. Wizard stamps? Oh, yeah, Wizards, Wizards of the Coast. Of the coast. Yes. Uh... So, I did not see those, actually. <laughs> Would you like to do the honors? Because this is yours. Uh, sure, 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 sure. Because this is your... Uh, it is cellophane. And it's your Valentine's gift. It is my Valentine's present. And I think you got it on... Release day. Release day, yeah. So that was pretty special. pre-release day, I should say. Unfortunately, I haven't been able to open it yet. And I'm still having trouble. Yeah. This is what happens when you remain. cut your fingernails. <laughs> going to remain unopened. Oh, we'll just have to guess what the cards are inside. <laughs> well, that was a pretty cool card. Wow, it's a foil card. That's amazing. <laughs> oh, we should have oh, done this off camera. No, this is great. I got this content. <laughs> this is content, people. Right? I got some content for you. Yay. Okay. Kamigawa. Mm hmm <gasps> I was trying to do it without getting a nice glare in the... Oh, well, you got a nice glare. Ooh, look! It's like a display Ooh, box. Oh, guys, it's just like what you would see uh, at Walmart back in the day when they actually had cards. We're going to sell you these cards for like $5 a pack. Ooh, cool. Ooh, special art. Yeah. Well, now this makes me wonder what happens to all this special art. I know. There it is. They either Beautiful. keep it or they toss it. Beautiful. I know. Shameful. Or they, sell it. They probably toss it, and that's what makes probably me sad. Sell it. Whoa! Look at that sword. That's pretty cool. That's Kato. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure what the other character is. It probably mm -hmm. says on the back if you flip it over. Nope. It says meet Kato. Well, that doesn't help me much. Mm -hmm. Too bad I didn't get the manga that I was trying to get. Yeah. Apparently, it's online only. 
Yeah, that was weird. Well, it, it's probably common, and I just haven't explored that right, so what aspect do we, how of things. Do, how I do guess we, do we this? just pop them open. Let's There's do this. There's 32? There's 32 in here? Let's start ripping! <gasps> this is a, officially our first, like, booster. Booster box. Booster box yeah. of any card set that yes. we've ever collected. It is. Because only have we ever bought individual packs. Now, when we were like doing Wheel of Time packs, cards back in the day. We made sets, decks, and stuff yeah. like that. Yeah. When we were doing Wheel of Time cards back in the day, we probably bought enough at one time right. to make up a box, but we've never had an unopened cellophane right. wrap box. Right. This was fresh. You can smell Let me the see. factory air. It smells like sushi. <laughs> like cyber sushi. It smells like Oil, engine oil. Mm, that does not. <laughs> Smells okay. like cyber sushi. I'm gonna go with that. All right, uh, Kamigawa. Mm. Do you want to? America runs on Duncan. Do you want to? Do you want to crack the first pack? Crack the pack. It's a crack a pack attack. Because it is yours after all. Oh my goodness, there's so many. All right, cards. this time, guys, I brought my table magnifier. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I can actually look at the you can cards. Actually read them. Becky's still probably going to read them. But yeah, I'll still do it like in front of yeah. the camera and everything. But I'm going to... You're going to... There we go. Should there be majestic music? <laughs> I can... <laughs> Why is it always <laughs> Star Wars? Because <laughs> that's the first thing that came to mind. Okay. I could go... But of course it's Japanese inspired, so none of those matter. Yeah, that's true. Japanese inspired. <laughs> oh, wow. I got your picture. I got your picture. Are we doing any sort of like one, two and cards? In the I, I think it's two. Or do you want to just I think it kind of. We got? Go ahead and go do two. Let's see where that takes us. Because I, I, I really think it's two. Whoop. But then we get specialty cards and stuff get, like this that throws us all off. And that's like, I don't know what's going on. Okay, yeah. here we go. Oh, it's a shiny. It's a shiny. So maybe one. Maybe one. I don't but know. we've done that before and then had like, well, whatever. I don't know. Let's do it. Okay. What do we got? Repel the vial. Yes. I enjoy repelling the vial. And we got a blank card. <laughs> nice. You know, and we, we got a. I'll keep those separate. It'll help me a little and bit. And a Kamigawa Neon Dynasty. What is that? Junji, the Midnight Sky Chase Stone. Ooh, it's a oh. cool art card. That is cool. Oh, I need to set, show that again. No, that I'm was... going to look at it okay. real quick. All right. Sweet. Well, I'm going to read through these. I might keep that in my pocket. Okay. Just as like a... Let me, let me show that. Like oh, it's charm. like it's like laminate. Laminate. That is cool. <laughs> laminate. Does it go this way? Boy, 32 decks is going to take a while to get through if we keep getting <laughs> cards like this. <laughs> It's gonna be a long video, guys. This is the longest video I of hope, our life. I hope you brought Duncan. Duncan. <laughs> America runs on Duncan. Actually, <laughs> most of the time America sits and gets fatter on Duncan. That's the truth. Yeah. So it's good. the prednisone talking. Oh the prednisone talking? Or is it the caffeine talking? Well, it's the prednisone that's making me fat. <laughs> it's the caffeine that's talking. Yeah, that's more like it. Yeah. All right, Swiftwater Cliffs. Swiftwater. Ooh. I need my glasses. <laughs> well, why don't you get them? I didn't bring my glasses. All right, we're going to pause after this deck. Yes, <laughs> we'll restart the video. Uh, yeah, these are cool. Okay, so let me yeah. explain. Okay. So they have different cards in different um, sets okay. that allow, um, allow you to get mana from two different uh, colors, if that makes sense. So this is from red or blue. Okay. Um, which is great, but if you notice the other effect on it, can you read that? Uh, Swiftwater Cliffs enters the battlefield tapped. Mm -hmm. When Swiftwater Cliffs enters the battlefield, you gain one life. So just by playing that card, it's, mm -hmm. it gives you a life, which is awesome. Um, so I'm okay. really liking them as opposed to um, the last time around. Mm -hmm. uh, I think it was more for, um, what was it, Carheim? Was it Carheim? Yeah, the Vikings. Is that, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, is, it, is that what it was called, though? Caldheim. Caldheim, Caldheim. man. Caldheim, wow. I, I really we watched are, that. Yeah, that was so old. We are such magic fans. That <laughs> Caldheim, that's right. I knew I knew Carheim wasn't right, but I kept wanting to say it <laughs> for some reason. Um, so in Caldheim, uh, these were snow cards, and okay. they were really cool, 
and they had all of that except for the life. And so okay. that little edge of yeah. uh, getting one life can make or break you, especially on a white deck. And I'm particularly partial to white and light right. green decks. Let's move on. No, I'm telling you stuff. That's Reinforced important. Reinforced Ronin. Ooh. Ooh. He sounds fancy. Imperial Subduer. That's some cool art. I'll try to keep one. them in the video screen better so the the viewer can see. Hey, viewer, I hope you enjoy this. I'm doing a lot of work for you. Reckoner Shakedown. Mm-hmm. I can hardly see what's going on in that card. It's so yeah, bad. and that's my problem with the physical cards. Chain Flail Centipede. Ooh, he looks dangerous. Is he green? Uh, blue? Blue. No, black. Oh, that makes sense if he's black. Just has a little skull. Yeah, he's black. Uh, Tawashi Song Shaper. Oh, cool. It's like a DJ. Tawashi. <laughs> like a DJ? Yeah. <laughs> oh, whoop. Oh, well, that makes sense. A song shaper that's like a DJ. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I like that. Acquisition octopus. A lot of artifact creatures in Kamigawa. Mm -hmm. I'm not really uh, mm, Web up on that yet. Cuff. Ooh, it's like a spider on your wrist. Yeah, I played with one of those the other day. Ooh. Boseju reaches skyward. That's a saga. So you play that as an enchantment mm -hmm. and it sort of sits to the side. And then on turn one, this effect happens. Mm -hmm. On turn two, this effect happens. Mm -hmm. And on turn three, the third effect happens. Okay. So well, it's pretty cool. And um, so on turn three, mm -hmm. you get that. Uh, oh! Does that make sense? So he turned it over. Yeah, so on that. turn three. Let me do that again. It, it, and in Kamigawa, you get a creature so on turn three turn on your sagas. Three. You flip it over. Yep. So now and he's a... And you get Branch of the Boseju. No, he's a creature, I think. Or is it Enchantment a... creature plant. Yeah. Yep. Yep. That's cool. Looks like a little bonsai. So anytime you see the saga, it'll have a backwards card. The Long Reach of Night. Ooh, that's a scary one. So then there's a... Yep. Oh, okay. So you get that creature Animus at the third turn. Animus of Night's mm -hmm. Reach. And the creature has its own effects, you know. Yeah, I see that. There's a which whole, is pretty cool. whole list of text. So I'm really enjoying the sagas. Um... Yeah. Tribute to Harobi. And that is our rare. Yep, and uh, I think he's rats. And Echo of Death's Wall. Whale so, or Wall? I think it says Whale. Whale. <laughs> yeah, my, it's, a, um, it's a bell. That's your uh, creature. So if you turn it back around. So, but it has little rats in there. So turn one. Can you read it? Each opponent creates a 1 1 black rat so, creature token. Here's what you do The Rats of Nim. You create them. So you create a rat for them, basically. Oh, okay. So they get to have a rat, a 1-1 one, one rat creature that they can use to fight you and everything. Okay. And then on turn two, the same thing. Right. But on turn three, you get to have all the rats that they have back. Mm. So you get to play those rat tokens now. Okay. Um, That's cool. And you get the, what is it, what is it? Whale, Echo of Death, Death's Whale, which allows you to sacrifice low-level creatures to have some cool effects. Mm -hmm. So okay. that's why... That's nice. why the one one rats. All right. But like all black decks, you're taking a little bit. You take a little bit of a gamble when you play it because mm -hmm. you're giving them creatures that they can use against you. Okay. All right. Well, that's it for this video, guys. <laughs> Just kidding. Actually, I'm gonna pause it and I'll be right back because I can barely see these break. cards. <laughs> I'll be right back. Someone's getting old. What? Well, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so you know what they say, a minute stuff. on your lips, a lifetime on your hips. <laughs> oh, we're back. We're back. Yes. Do I look smarter now? <laughs> you look so intelligent. Thanks. <laughs> All right. Pack number two. You know, sometimes looks can be deceiving. Never judge a book by its cover. But that's not true in your case. Okay, thanks, I guess. <laughs> The art on the card is really cool, by the way. The art on the cover. On the on the card pack. Mm -hmm. on the pack. That yes. is the Wanderer. See, glasses don't make me any smarter. Yes, they do. <laughs> I, just... mean, I mean, wait. No, they don't. You are already very smart oh, without them. Oh, thanks. <laughs> thanks. Uh... Those just reflect the inside. Oh. I'm still confused. 
<laughs> yeah, I'm not sure if we're in compliment territory <laughs> or not, and uh, I wish I hadn't gone there I ever. Don't know. <laughs> I'm oh, sorry. That's upside down. Okay. Um. That's a token. All right. Well, here's that's a that. token. Again, that's I'm not token. sure. Oh, that's that's, that's right. your that's, art card. Oh, that's right. What that's a so cool art. art card. Oh, see, I already opened. Man, one I really like these art cards. Yeah. Look at that. That is beautiful. Uh-oh, here comes a cat. Oh, my goodness. A cat okay. on a Redeemed Otaku podcast. All right, there's your art card. What uh, are you doing? Gage. Oh, my goodness. She wants to be magnified. She wants to come over and see the cards. Okay, so, oops, this is the front. That was the back. Good. All right, let's just do it. Let's just go with it. Oh, well, the video's shaking. Oh, because you have a cat tromping around. Basic land. Basic? Island. Is it foil or something? Nope. Okay. It says basically. Flip it over. Make sure there's nothing on the back. There's nothing on the back. Oh, nothing on the back. Okay. Ooh. I don't know what you're laughing Heiko about. Heiko Yamazaki, the general. That is a human samurai legendary creature. Is it Heiko <laughs> or Heiko? Heiko. Heiko. It's H-E-I. Oh. Heiko. I thought it might have been. I can't read it from here. So. Ah, well, there you go. You I'm making assumptions. Oh, my goodness, Gage. You're going to have to probably get her We're away because... Because she's walking across the table and she. We have a everything. very wobbly... We're not in the midst of an earthquake. <laughs> no, it's just a cat quake. <laughs> goodness, what are you doing? <laughs> I made a joke. All right. <laughs> Here we go. Searchlight companion. Mm. Helpful. Oh, it looks like a little spirit fox thing. Mm -hmm. There's That's a lot cool. of foxes in this. That's cool. Actually, is it a fox? Uh, it just says artifact creature drone. I think that's the okay. searchlight companion. Yeah, there is are. That the searchlight companion. Or it's a one? drone. Which one's the? Search? So there's a fox in the background. Is all. It's just or part in of the, the foreground. Okay. Um, yeah, I see what you're saying. Okay. But I think that's your drone. Okay. Kami of terrible secrets. Oh, it's a kami. Kami. Ecologist Terrarium. Mm -hmm. Ah, it's like a bonsai. little bonsai. Mm -hmm. Okay. Told you, very Japanese flavored. Nazumi Blade Blesser. Oh, what do you do for a living? I bless blades. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Rat Samurai. Rat Samurai. You know, that's what I would be in an MMORPG. There's one, I hope we get it, but there's one character uh -huh. that's actually um, a rat who's like a trainer, like a sensei. Oh. Yeah. Oh, like Splinter, Master Yeah, Splinter. and there's some call there's a few call outs at Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Nice. There's a turtle as well. It's All a right. it's a kappa, but it's you totally know it's a yeah, turtle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is Naomi Pillar of Order. Human advisor. I advise. Assassin's Inc. Like wait, like I N C I N K. Oh, okay. Because that would be pretty cool. Oh, like Incorporated? Like, Assassin's, Assassin's Incorporated. <laughs> LLC. <laughs> All rights reserved. Go Shintai of Hidden Cruelty. Mm. Ooh, it's a shrine. Shrines have some really cool abilities, if you can read that off. Okay, Death Touch. At the okay, so Death your... Touch, let's start with that. Okay. Death Touch, if you don't know, um, means that anytime that hits another card, kills it. it kills it. So, very few exceptions to that. So that's pretty cool. Go ahead. Okay. At the beginning of your end, okay. At the beginning of your end step, you may pay one. When you do, destroy target creature with toughness X or less, where X is the number of shrines you control. So, you pay one mm -hmm. mana. If you have any mana left, you can pay one mana. Okay. If you have one shrine in play, you can kill a, a creature with a, a toughness of one. If you have two shrines in play, you can kill a creature with a, t a toughness of two. So on and so forth, all the way up to however many shrines Without you have in play. Without having to use this to death touch them? You don't have to do anything. Mm -hmm. You just have to use one mana. That's so cool. shrines are one of those things that the more you have in play, and the more variety you have in play, the cooler effects you have. Because they all so have different effects like the that. The flavor text says, it seeks those with hate in their hearts and offers vengeance. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, if you think about, like, an anime, mm -hmm. an anime with, uh, where there's, like, a shrine, what's the shrine about? Mm -hmm. It's always a specific spirit or god 
that has a specific purpose, right? Mm -hmm. It's not like a general, come here and pray. No, it's come here and pray about your crops or come here and pray about right. your baby or come here and pray about whatever, you know? Right, right. So that's what these are, is they have a very specific purpose. And the more that you have, the more powerful uh, their effect is, which okay. is pretty cool. Befriending the moths. Oh, that's a fun one. Moths, okay, let me flip it over. Yep, and you get a moth. And you guys have Mothra, I mean, Imperial Moth. Oh, <laughs> we wouldn't want to introduce Mothrianity into this. No, well, uh, we'll keep that, we'll keep that on the podcast. <laughs> uh, biting Palm Ninja. What? Let me bite your palms. Okay, oh, no, 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 oh, no. Oh, 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 it's Vampire Hunter D. Look at that. He's got awesome little human ninja his hands actually have like I know. they actually bite yeah biting yeah. palm like like vampire hunter d okay i don't oh. remember that in vampire hunter oh d. you don't oh um, we need to watch some vampire hunter d then probably live without it <laughs> i've seen it before i just don't remember that particular okay. thing but i know it's a trope in anime <laughs> yeah, that yeah there's something in your hand and it's like ah. yeah surprise no high fives for you yeah um ooh, and that's our rare that's the rare on that? nope. okay. no no Futurist operative. Oh. Oh, why is it so blue? Probably because it's a blue card. And it's a foil. It's shiny. Oh, that's why. Oh, I think everyone has everyone guaranteed foil and art card. So every pack has one. Okay. That's a really good. You got, you grabbed a really good one back. Yeah. Because there's some fun stuff in there. I did not know what I was getting. And this, I think, is just. Oh, that's. It's a, a token. token. Yeah. Okay. Shrine. Hey, we know what a shrine is used for. It's already shrine. All right, here we go. The next pack. I got a shrine. And the next pack. Oh, there we go. There we go. To win, after all guesses have been made, each player reveals the correct match for their image. If every card was matched correctly, or correctly matched, everyone wins. What does that mean? I have no idea. I don't either. Magical minigame Cyber Simulacrum. Okay. Oh, there you go. That's a mini game, apparently. Interesting. We're just going to flip them over, guys. We're just going to go for it, okay? And this will be our art card. Art card. Whoops. If I do this correctly. Ooh. I really like the art cards. That is so... I don't know exactly what I'm looking at, but it's kind of cool. Like, is that his teeth right there? Keefs. Oh yeah, I think that's what I think that's what I'm looking at. There you go. Magnify it. Magnify it. Oh, here comes the catzilla again. Oh my goodness, Geisha. Geisha. Oh my goodness. And she's named Geisha. How fitting for our Kamigawa opening. Geisha, you gotta get down. <laughs> Boy. All right, we got Tranquil Cove. Another one of those. Uh... Yeah. Either mana that yeah. gives you life, which is pretty cool. Ink Rise Infiltrator. So Ink is a, a clan or something. Mm. Ink Rise Infiltrator gets plus two, plus two until end of turn. There's, uh, I know in Kamigawa there's inked individuals. Mm -hmm. So the Thieves Guild is inked. Mm -hmm. And their tattoos actually induce loyalty amongst themselves. Okay. So loyalty among thieves, but mm -hmm. their ink actually enforces that. Okay. And then there's um, like a group or a clan of scribes that actually has like the history of Kamigawa, the mm -hmm. world, mm -hmm. kind of written on them. <gasps> Low power mode, oh no! <laughs> oh, my phone, <laughs> I might have to pause it again <laughs> and charge my world. phone. <laughs> mm. Okay. All right, we'll go through like one or two more packs, pause it, I guess. get a plug, I'll get a, I'll find a plug and plug in my phone. Okay, Ink Rise Infiltrator. Wow. Oh man, Sunblade Samurai. That's some cool art. Another human samurai, that is cool. Regent's Authority, oh, it looks like a fox. Before her spark pulled her away again, the emperor appointed the wise Light Paws to guide Kamigawa in her absence. Kamigawa. So I actually have that image mm -hmm. on a sleeve in my ah, Magic the Gathering nice. Arena game. Pretty okay. cool. Golden Tail Disciple. It's a lynx. Is it lynx? Looks like. Oh, is it a? Oh, is it a kitsune? Nope. Yep. Okay. Never mind. A lot of foxes, but I haven't Fox seen any monk. lynxes. Oh, it just looks like. It's just probably because I can't really make out the art. 
Okay. Lifelink. Students of the Kitsune-led Golden Tail Academy in Eganjo are unparalleled in both martial skill and dedication to the Imperial cause. Here's Lifelink. Yes. That's pretty cool. Oh, it's a Shiba Inu! Spirited Companion. Enchantment Creature, Doge. Doge, it says? <laughs> no, it says Doge. Because that would be epic if it said Doge. <laughs> I'd be like, whoa! <laughs> Oh, man, that'd be hilarious. Uh, a Ganjo Exemplar. <clears throat> Human Samurai. Human Samurai. Ooh, Flame Discharge. That sounds like a painful disease. <sighs> that sounds what happened, Lex. That's after too much that's Taco not, Bell. Yeah, I was trying to make a joke about Taco Bell, but you, I, it didn't come out right. <laughs> that's oh, after you used to, had the lava sauce back in the day. <gasps> I had one of them lava tacos. I'm gonna have a flame discharge. Woo! Instant. It's instant. <laughs> it's instant. <laughs> Taco Bell card. Hashtag Taco Bell. That one's for Jesse. <laughs> uh, Upriser Renegade. Mmm. Oh, that sounds okay. like you after Taco Bell, too, now that I think about it. I don't know. Is it really? <laughs> <laughs> That's after the it. flame discharge, like a half hour later. Oh, I got yes. an upriser at Renegade! <laughs> Why'd you have to put in the actions? <laughs> oh, it's an upriser Renegade! <laughs> oh, goodness. All right. <laughs> the long reach of night. Mm. Did we see this one? I think, was, did we see this one? No. I don't no, either. Animus of Night's Reach. I don't remember if we saw that one or not. I don't remember either. Those are really cool cards, though. Inventive iteration. I'm glad they're loading me up on uh, sagas because yeah. that's really yeah. good stuff. Living breakthrough. Which one was the rare? Did we did I miss? Oh nope, that's the rare. That's okay. your rare. Okay. All right. And then there's the foil seismic wave. That sounds like something that would happen after Taco Bell. <laughs> Kamigawa, not sponsored by Taco Bell. <laughs> <laughs> not at all. Oh my goodness. All right, here we go. Let's do this pack. Kamigawa. We'll pause it, plug in my phone, and see what other jokes we can make. Whoop. Mm. America runs on Duncan. I gotta get that in there. Look, I'm gonna help you all out. Oh, look at that. QR Scan code. that. Scan that QR code. Pause the video and scan it. Be the best player in the room. In I want to be arena. the very best. I can all get it There you go. There's your garbage card. Pretty much. Okay. And our art card is... Our art of the day. Why are you doing that? <laughs> because this is the lamest art I've seen today. It has, it has a different text... Um, oh. Texture, so it's actually like sticking to the cards. Blame the texture. Oh, that's cool. I don't know what it is, but it's, it's a lady with some fans. Uh, I think she's the emperor. Oh, we got the empress. Nope. Oh, the emperor. Correct. <gasps> oh boy. Oh, oh what is that's this? land. This Look how pretty land. that land. That's a wow, fire card. That's how pretty Mount, that is. Mount Fuji. That is that's cool. my next purchase on uh, online. Oh, there's two. It's pretty twenty-five thousand in-game gold. So I'm really saving my pennies oh, to get it. Oh, that is cool, man. Because that's an awesome set. Beautiful set. Yeah, so that's... That's wow. land. Yep. So yeah, is I that, think that's the Empress. So that's something we want to look for, then, if we get more of those. Oh, heck yeah. Nice. That's a... Okay. If I could do a whole land, like, do a whole deck, whole deck with, with that, that land, land, I don't that think I'll cool. ever be able to do that, but... So I've seen this one already, Ink Rise Infiltrator. Yep. Ooh, a Silver Fur Master. Oh, that's it, right? The Rat, rat Ninja? No. Is it? Silver Fur Master, it says. What's his, uh, what's his mana? Uh, where's that at? Up here? Yeah. Just one water. Yeah, one, that's him. One water and one black. Yeah, he's a, he's a, he's a, uh, blue and black. Blue and black. Mm -hmm. Nice. Oh, he doesn't have any flavor text, though. But you oh, know what he is. Flavor text. I know, flavor, give you some flavor text. There you go, there we go. We got the rat master sensei. And he's a, he has the nin, he's a rat ninja. Yes. Paper craft decoy. 
Oh, cool. Art of crap. Art. Art of crap. Artifact creature. Frog. <laughs> Frog. Frog. Wanderer's intervention. Nothing fun to say about that one. Uh, Tamiyo's safekeeping. Mm. Okay. What is it? Is it an enchantment? It's that one chick from the opening from this thing. It's her. Yeah, but what That's is it? That's Tamiyo. Tamiyo. I don't know her lore. Oh, well. okay. So it says target permanent you control gains hexproof and indestructible until end of turn. You gain two life. Okay. And then in parentheses, it says a permanent with hexproof and indestructible can't be the target of spells or abilities your opponents control. Damage and effects that say destroy don't destroy it. It's an instant. Yes. And it what what color is the mana? Uh, green. Green. It's a tree. So okay. So what you use her for mm -hmm. is if you've got a card that you don't want dead. And it was a sure bet when you threw it out there mm -hmm. to, to block, let's say. You're okay. going to use this mostly on a block. Okay. So it's on a block. And all of a sudden, they throw some crazy card out there that's going to make sure that your favorite card is going to be dead. Okay. Now you, and you have one green mana set aside. So you can drop her and not counteract the spell, but give yourself enough... Uh, protection basically to keep it from okay. killing you <clears throat> plus you gain a couple life because you know that never hurt anybody Tommy like green. Comp what is that compilation comp no compilation what is that word no, so I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. This would be for because it's hexproof and indestructible mm -hmm. so this would be if they're throwing a spell at your dude that's gonna knock them out of the game okay that's what that would be Okie dokie. Reality heist. Completion. That's but not it's how spelled, you spell I know completion. it's spelled weird because it's a game, but I think that's what it's supposed to be. Okay. Completion. Whatever you say, Kamigawa. Kamigawa! A uh, prosperous thief. These are all blue. So these all go to Kaito. This is all Kaito stuff. Kaido. Right? Is blue? Yeah. The modern age. Ooh, that's cool. It's like the Matrix. Yeah, it's very Matrix. It has definite elements of the Matrix. And so then, oh, Vector Glider. Ooh, it's like Tron. I'm a Vector Glider. There you go. Well, you'll find a lot of little call-outs to... Takenuma Abandoned Mire. Geeky that's stuff our in magic. Legendary Land. And it's our rare. Ooh, there's a special effect to Legendary Lands. Oh, that's cool. And Discover the Impossible, which is our foil card. That sounds like a self-help book. <laughs> Kamigawa, the self-help book. The self-help? Self Did I say self-help? Self-help, yeah. Self-help. Pretty much what it is. <laughs> All right, so. Yeah, that's all the cards. That's all the cards. Pause the video. Take a look at the Duncan break. America runs on Duncan. Mm -hmm. Here, if you haven't had a chance yet, scan that code. <laughs> We'll be right back. <laughs> After these messages. <laughs> Are you going to finish it? No, well, you were supposed to. <laughs> we'll be right back. All right. We're back. Hi. Thankfully, my tablet's all charged up because I made sure that, that was charged. And now my phone's plugged in. <laughs> so Half the battle. Continue opening. Kamigawa. Kamigawa. All right. But now I got a cord hey. in my way. So professional. Okay. I'm sure people use cords all the time in recording. Oh man. That's why it's called recording. Mm. It means to cord again after all. After all. After all, it does mean to cord again. Okay. Oh, I'll try not to do the thing it's that the art do. card. Oh. It's a specialty card that has yeah. no purpose other than to look cool. So wait. This way? No. Uh, don't overthink it. It's art. Well, there's this it's art. icon there. It's art. There's your art card. Art! Hey! 
There's one of your cool lands. It's cool land. Looks like, what is it, water? Uh, green, it's trees. I can't. <laughs> Trying trees. to tell by the color, but I couldn't tell if it was green or blue. These trees. Well, it's close, sort of, because green has blue in it. Green does have blue in it. Okie dokie, Moon Snare Specialist. Moon Snare? Moon Snare. Moon Snare. Sounds like a kind of drum in a weird I know, band. Yeah, yeah. Simeon Sling. Uh oh. <laughs> we don't want to know what that Simeon Sling in. <laughs> Next. <laughs> Oh, it looks like snowballs. I think it's, we're okay. It's funny because they always say that like monkeys fling poo at the zoo and stuff. Mm -hmm. But I've seen a lot of monkeys at the zoo and I've never seen one actually fling I've poo. I've never seen one fling poo. And I always check out the monkeys. I love primates. We always do go see the monkeys. That's, I, I, that's like, I don't care about seeing much else. I want to see the primates and the lizards. They're usually not doing much. Um, That's not true. A lot of times sometimes. the monkeys are really joyous to They're see just us. just kind of like sitting there looking at you, maybe jumping a little bit. Certainly yes. not flinging poo. I've never seen them fling poo. There you go. But that being said, if you've seen monkeys fling poo. Fling poo. Fling poo. <laughs> fling poo. Leave a comment. <laughs> Especially if you've seen poo. We do actually make a little game about when we go to the zoo, how many animals we see urinating or defecating. <laughs> Pooping or peeing because or other bodily functions. It actually happens a lot if you're looking for it. <laughs> we actually have an niece that got peed on by a tiger. Yes. <laughs> Yes. Um, she was very excited to have that happen to her. It was pretty stinky, too. She wasn't excited at that. <laughs> no. <laughs> All right, Iron Apprentice. Oh. Does that mean, like, it's, like, not quite iron yet, but one day it will be iron? It's striving to be iron. Striving to become iron? Mm -hmm. First it's Does apprentice, it... then it's journeyman. Then it's, a ma <laughs> then it's master iron. <laughs> master iron! <laughs> iron master. <laughs> well, that'd be a pretty cool title. Dramatis Puppet. Mm. Clawing Torment. Ooh. Uh, that's happened to me after Taco Bell, too. It's happened to me in my dreams. Runaway Trash Bot. <laughs> that's happened. <laughs> the Runaway Trash Bot from Taco Bell's after me. <laughs> Taco Bell's gonna sue us. Hashtag Taco Bell. <laughs> Hashtag demonetized. <laughs> We actually don't make any money because we don't have enough followers. No. So if you'd like us to make money, tell your friends about this channel. Say, you Subscri guys won't believe these weirdos. Subscribe They're to so the channel. Bizarre. How bizarre. Go How Shentai bizarre? of Ancient War. A Gosh Shentai? Go Shentai. Oh. Go Shentai. Go Shentai. Like, go ninja, go ninja, go. Go Shentai, go Shentai, go. <laughs> it actually works. <laughs> oh, man. Hashtag Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 2. Secret of the Ooze. <laughs> was that even a good one, though? Like It was really... It was the funniest one. Okay. It was the funniest one. Go Shentai and so Boundless long Vigor. Since I've seen them. Another Go Shentai? Yeah. Okay. Boundless Vigor? Oh, this is a shrine. Oh, well, good thing, because shrine. we have Boseju Reaches Skyward. Boseju, Boseju. Boseju is that tree. Yes. It floats in the sky. The plant. I think. Kotose the Silent Spider. Ooh. Oh, he's a cool card. Human ni Ninja. Yeah. It's the rare. I have to check out his, uh, not his flavor text, but his effects. Oh, okay. It's pretty cool. All right, let's see. When Kotose the Silent Spider enters the battlefield, mm. exile target card other than a basic land card from an opponent's graveyard. Mm -hmm. Search that player's graveyard, hand, and library for any number of cards with the same name as that card and exile them. Then that player shuffles. For as long as you control Kotose, you may play one of the exiled cards and you may spend mana as though it were mana of any color to cast it. So. Wow. Let's say he's got a fireball in the deck. Yes. I don't know. Okay. Continue. And you're like, um, yeah, I don't want I don't want him to hit me with any more of those. Uh -huh. You can go into his graveyard, pluck that one out, ex exile it, which means it takes it out of the game. Right. And then you go through his hand and his library. For any others. It For the exact same card and exile all of those. Mm -hmm. And then one of them. You can use. You can use at any point in the game as long as you have mana. With no specific yeah. color cost. Awesome card. That is pretty awesome. There you go, Kotose. But 
see how he's a legendary creature? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Legendary creature means you can only have one of them in, in play at any mm -hmm. time. So you can have up to four in your hand if you're using a standard but deck, but you can only ever have one in play. So if all you have is four of them in your hand, SOL. not great. But as soon as he's dead, you can do it again. Ooh, Thundersteel Colossus. <laughs> There's the vehicle. There's That's the mech. That's one of them. Yeah. yeah. Is that the 7-7 seven, seven one? Uh, yeah, 7-7. Seven, seven. Yeah. Well, that's cool. So see what his crew is? Uh, crew two. That means you only have to have power of two. So like, let's take this guy, right? Kotose. He's got four, four. Okay. So he would crew, he'd be able to crew it, just him. So now instead oh, of it being four, because he has see. to have a power of two. I see. So you could I have see. two one ones or one, two, one or something like that. But he sits on the side like an enchantment basically. Mm -hmm. And then when you pull them out, you have to tap one of these cards, mm. okay, or two, or however many it takes to make up a crew of two gotcha. power. Um, but now my 4-4 four, four has become a 7-7. Seven, seven. Mm. And when he attacks, let's say he gets killed, mm -hmm. I haven't risked this dude. Oh, so all of his effects are still in play. So only he gets Yeah. Killed. Nice. Isn't that cool? Nice. Well, vehicles are fun. Okay. okay. And they're all like mech suits in this game. Oh, we got two. Or in this, oh, wait. In this expansion. Yeah, we got two. We got two? Kotose <gasps> He's was a planeswalker. Rare? Oh, this is Teferi, Hero of Dominaria. Mm. Nice. Dominaria? Why is he in a Kamigawa deck? Does uh -huh. he have the Kamigawa sy symbol? Where's the Kamigawa symbol at? Is that so the it's a little mountain. mountain. No. It's not a mountain? What is it? Oh, I don't know. Did we get an error card? I think we got an error card back. It's like a little shield. Yeah, he shouldn't be in there. Look. A little gold shield. Look. They all have the little mountain. Yeah, the little mountain is Kamigawa. Oh. We got something from another deck. We got it from Dominaria. Guys. We just... That's... <laughs> you don't know how exciting that is. Man. Whoa. I think, I think this video is going to hit a million... Dude, Views. that's actually <laughs> beyond cool. So not only did we get an error uh -huh. from another, a completely, like, that's not even current, okay? Dominaria is not Yeah, that's current. not even current. Wow. So not only did we get a non-current card in Kamigawa, okay, <laughs> but it's a rare non-current card. And a planes, yeah, it's like... And, and, oh yeah, by the way, it's a planeswalker. Hello. Dude. Sleeve that okay, up. Okay, this needs to be clipped. <laughs> that little piece. <laughs> okay, we'll clip that. Woo! Okay, <laughs> end of video. We're done. That's it. We can't get better no, than that. No. There's no way. We're not done. We actually have a lot more to go. <laughs> we might have to split this into two. I think we're going to have to split this video into two. <laughs> How many more do you want to do? How many more is there? Oh my gosh. There's there's stacks and stacks. Come and go up, part Look, seven. It looks like it's barely been touched. Guys, it's barely been touched. Barely been touched. You think 32 and you're like, oh, it's not much. Yeah, it's like no. a walk in the park. But when you're looking at every card and then talking about it, that actually, it's a lot. This walker got me a little that's, too excited. Yeah. It really did. That's awesome. That, yeah, that's, that's crazy. Okay. You, you do need to clip that one little piece out. Sure, I will. I'll and, do it. And, and, wow, because that was, that's really cool. All right. So how many cards did we end up pulling out of that? Did you, did we I didn't count, count? them. No, no, I didn't count I mean, them either. I don't count them because. All right, there's 12 cards in these, so let us know be. when you re when you watch that. Or maybe we'll How many it. videos? How many oh. videos? How many videos were there? <laughs> count them all. I either need new glasses or more coffee. <laughs> Go on the Redeemed Otaku uh, YouTube page and count the number of videos that Duncan. are on. Duncan. America runs from Duncan. I mean, on Duncan. No, yeah, there you go. All right, here we go. Coming up, uh, kind of exciting because, like, I'm like excited. I, I mean, <laughs> that's not a common occurrence. My heart's beating fast. That's the coffee. Though. Oh, that's the coffee. Of course. Highly caffeinated. <laughs> All right, here's one of those other weird magic mini game mini things. Mini game booster sleuth. Booster sleuth. And here we go. Yeah, I'm putting that with my non-standard cards. There we go. So it likes to grip that. Oh, man. Some of this art is really cool. Oh, look. We got a mini one of that art. A mini one of that art. So I wonder. Oh. I wonder. Man. Oh, one, 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 Like the, the big one that you get? 
Mm. I wonder if there's a different one in each box. Oh, I guess we'll have to go buy seven we'll more. We have to go buy some more boxes. There you go. Mm. Ooh, look at that red it's land. It's Kaito. No, black. Kaito. The skull is black, right? Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, it's red light district. They're so cool. Oh, it's a foil, too. Is it? Yes. Come on. Wow. We're getting some really good cards. <laughs> wow. That is slick. Wow. Okay. Jukai Trainee. Human Samurai. Human Samurai. It's like all of these are lame now. I know, right? Golly. Just get to the good stuff already. You saw that one already. Voltage Surge. What is that song? Can we skip to the good part? I don't know. Can we? It's like a wipe in TikTok videos where they're like... I don't watch TikTok videos. Oh, short videos. <laughs> whatever you want to call them. I don't really watch TikTok either, but I see them on Facebook and YouTube. Kami's Flame. Yes. Ooh. I could make another Taco Bell joke, but I won't. <laughs> Kami of Industry. That's yeah. definitely a Taco Bell joke in there. No, it's not. Oh, okay. <laughs> Tawashi Guidebot. Excuse me, I burped. No, oh, why? It's the Duncan. Why does it smell like that? <laughs> America runs on Duncan. Uh, walking skyscraper. Ooh. Man. Michiko's Reign of Truth. Oh, I haven't seen that one. Okay, so the chick with the fans? Mm -hmm. I think that's Michiko. Maybe. There's Michiko. Oh, no. Portrait of Michiko. I think Michiko's the Empire Emperor. But she I could be wrong. Human Noble. Okay, so let's look at the flavor text. Long ago, as the first mortal to bond with Kyodai, Michiko Kondo brought an end to the Kami War and guided Kamigawa into an age of truth and harmony. Hmm. Yeah. Kind of sounds like the Emperor. Yeah, so, de definitely. Invoke Calamity! Oh. It's like a purple card. What? It's a uh, shiny. I mean, uh, rare. It is a rare. So rare. So Ooh, we got another rare. rare. Brilliant Restoration. Ooh, looks like a dragon. That is cool. And another rare an uh -oh. <laughs> Reckoner Shakedown. It's a shiny. Shake me down. Those are Reckoner, cool. Reckoner, shake me down. Reckoner. Are we still recording? Okay, good. <laughs> you never heard that song? No, I've oh, never heard that. Oh, okay. You just made it up. All right, I'm kind of liking this Kamigawa. Kamigawa only because you got like a super weird Kamigawa. thing going on. Okay, here we go. It's an art card. Ooh. Ooh, look at that guy. Fancy. Oh man, he's cool. You want him to hang up in your room? He is so like cool. Like behind us. No, he might give me nightmares. You are so cool, but you give me nightmares. <laughs> well, there's like skulls and like weird snakes. And... Ooh, sounds like something from Warhammer 40k. Maybe. We'll have a 40k! Ooh, we got a shiny land! A basic mountain! Shiny, so shiny. See, the art on the regular lands is really cool, too. Yeah, yeah, but I like that. But that, um, oh, man. It's like the, how do you say it? Ikeoe? Something like that, sure. I think, I think that's how you say it. Ikeoe! Moon Circuit Hacker! Oh, yes. Human Ninja. Human Ninja. Ninjutsu. Dokuchi Silence. Oh, so quick oh, note about the oh. ninjutsu mm -hmm. effect. Mm -hmm. You'll see that on ninja cards. Yeah, this one has it. It allows you, if you pay that uh, ninjutsu cost, so this mm -hmm. one's one. Mm -hmm. I don't, I don't know what one's that one is. As well. Okay, so if you pay that cost, mm -hmm. you can actually pop him out and substitute another card in your hand. Oh. Or it, not in your hand, but. So you might have another mm -hmm. card attacking, and they're like, oh, one, one, that's no problem. Yeah. And then you ninjutsu <laughs> them. Ninjutsu! And it's like, it's oh, crap. oh, Yeah, see? So, Dokuchi Silencer. Very cool. Virus Beetle. Hmm. Yeah, he's got a cool little effect. Hmm. You drop him out there and, like, he's just a 1-1, one -one, nothing special. Mm -hmm. But you drop him out there and they have to discard a card. So, it's a fun, oh, like, sure. a first-round card. Yeah. You know? 
Seven tail mentor. There you go. He's, He's your boy. He's a fox samurai. He's a fox. The samurai all have t um, effects that are very sacrificial. So they can only attack by themselves mm -hmm. or they have to die in order to um, uh, bring about an effect or something. So okay. it's really interesting. Hmm. Um, it kind of fits what we know about samurai. very honorable samurai, you know. Samurai. Samurai. Dragonfly suit. So there's another vehicle. <gasps> Which one is he? Is he the flying one? <clears throat> yes, he's flying. Oh, so nice. So now you take a, like, how? what's his uh, cost? Crew one. Oh, beautiful. So now you take a crappy 1-1 one, one token, mm -hmm. right? That's not going anywhere. You're not doing anything with that guy. Mm -hmm. You tap it, and all of a sudden he does, what, 3-4 or something like that? 3-2. Three, 3-2. Two. Three, two. Okay, mm -hmm. so he's going to do 3 damage, <clears throat> and he's flying. So he's going up over everybody else, unless they have another flying card or a reach card. Mm -hmm. You're in Lake Flynn, man. You're doing some damages. Good stuff. Nice. I, like, I, I really like the suits. The mech suits are awesome. Suit up! Oh, Draw speaking of which. <laughs> Draw a card. Roaring Earth. Ooh, it looks like a bear. Roaring Earth? Nice. Yeah, Roaring Earth. It, it looks like a bear. Is it an enchantment? Yes. I think it's a land enchantment. Yes, he is green. A green no, bear. No, but I think it, you enchant the land. Oh, whenever land enters the battlefield under your control, put a plus one, plus one counter on target creature or vehicle you control. Oh, no. Okay. I have used this card um, in, in Arena. Mm. So that's why I was trying to remember what it was. Um, so, yeah, you keep him out. He's just an ongoing enchantment. Gotcha. And now every time you play a land of any kind, you can drop a plus one, plus one on one of your creatures, which is nice. So you, all of a sudden you're beefing up your your army just by playing mana, which nice. you're going to be doing anyways. All right. If you have mana in your hand, you're going to be dropping it in the field. So. Sounds like something you do in, after Taco Bell. <laughs> <laughs> if you have mana in your hand, you're going to be dropping it in the field. Roaring Earth! <laughs> okay, I was like, <laughs> I was a little scared based on my description, and then you said, <laughs> well, you have mana in your hand, you're going to be dropping it in the field. That sounds I mean, just like what happens after Taco Bell. It kind of fit. No, it doesn't. <laughs> There's nothing about that that fits. <laughs> I guess the taco could be mana, but then why would you be uh, dropping it in the field? <laughs> well, I mean, it could be a euphemism. For way later? <laughs> later in the day? If you have a mana in your hand, eventually. But that's not what I said. I'm just saying. Eventually, at some point in the future. Hashtag Taco Bell. Blossom Prancer. Oh, he's so cool. He is a cool one. He's a pretty okay. card. Tales of Master Seshiro. Another saga. Uh-huh. Flip it, and flip there's it. the... Master Seshiro. Seshiro's Living a Legacy. Oh, that's cool. I'm just a living legacy Ooh. to the leader of Snake the Warrior, band. Snake said. Invoke Despair. That definitely happens post-Taco Bell. <laughs> <laughs> It's kind of a self-invocation, <laughs> yeah. because you kind of do it to yourself. You kind of got to want Taco Bell after all this now. I know. What are we going to have for dinner tonight? America runs on Dunkin'. America also runs. On Taco Bell. On <laughs> Taco Bell. <laughs> Hashtag brought to you by Taco Bell. Oh, my goodness. All right. Ooh. We should go through as many. Lucky offering. I like him. Look at what he does. Okay. Destroy target artifact with mana value three or less. You so you've seen life. how many cards are artifact creatures. So yeah. he'll destroy. Sure. I've been paying attention to that. Well, no, but I, I mentioned it earlier. <laughs> okay. A lot, of the, a lot of the creatures in this game are, uh -huh. are, are enchantment creatures or artifact creatures. Okay. So he'll destroy any of those artifact creatures, including those suits. Oh. Okay. Those are artifacts, artifacts, life. artifacts. And you gain life. So he's, he's a, a fun pretty, card. He's pretty, a good card. Pretty powerful. And card. look how... Look how cheap he is. He's so cute. One. Yeah. One. Uh, let's see. The playful Kami reserved its greatest blessings for those who brought not wealth or rare delicacies, but particularly amusing trinkets. Da, 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 I like him. Da, da. Ooh, and a secret lair. I know. I want to get secret lair, and I hope I didn't miss... Uh... Construct. Oh, it's a token. Yep. Artifact creature. Told you. All right, you want to do how many more do you want to do? What time is it? Oh, I got to like get dinner started. Pushing midnight. I don't yeah. know. Um, two yeah, more? we'll do one more. Maybe one two more. more. 
But I, I really got to get dinner started if All we're right. going to eat tonight. Let us do... I thought we were going to talk about... <laughs> Let us do two more, okay? Dos mas. Two more. I will open one. Oh, you're going to open one? Okay. Yeah, sure, like you said, they're mine. I'll let you uh, open one. One of your cards. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Taco Bell, it's Is you it and me. Half empty or half full? I know it's our destiny. Taco Bell. Do you guys Ooh, find us amusing, by the way? My best friend <laughs> in the world we must defend. Because I find myself amusing. Taco Bell. All right, here we go. Our heart's so true. Oh, man. I'm like drooling. I'm laughing so hard at myself. Wow. Okay. Please wipe your fingers before you <laughs> dump my cards. <laughs> All right. Let's look at our art card and see what we got. I like art. Oh. Yeah. What am I looking at? I don't know. Dragon Ball Z. Yeah. Or uh, Reboot. You guys remember that reboot. show? I do. Hey, there's another one of your... Um, Only because you bring it up every day. First time I've said it. Do you in remember like reboot? Twenty years. Remember, remember reboot in it. I come on. I'm like, I'm even surprised that I remember it. There was a character named Dot Matrix in it, and she was my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even remember what the dude's name is. What's the dude's name? I don't know. Uh, Megabyte. Megabyte's the bad guy. Wasn't that Megabyte think, the bad guy? I don't know. I've seen the show like three times. <laughs> Leave a comment. Let us know <laughs> if you remember reboot. <laughs> Reboot. Rebooted. All right. Imperial Subduer. They did reboot it, by the way. Yeah. And people they might it. be thinking Rebooté Gilliman. What? Rebooté Gilliman. What is Rebooté Gilliman? Rebooté Gilliman. It sounds like a name. Yeah. Mm -mm. All right. Imperial Subduer. Have you never heard of Space Marines? Whoa. Primarchs. Do Dokuchi Shadow Walker. Dokuchi. <laughs> Dokuchi Shadow, what? What are you laughing about? Dokuchi. What? You said Dokuchi. Dokuchi. Sorry, I said it with the wrong accent. This cracks me up. <laughs> oh, never mind. Keep going. Okay. Dokuchi Shadow Walker. Ninjutsu. Oh, it's an ogre ninja. Ogre ninja. Cool. So probably a um, oni. Mm -hmm. That's what he looks like, actually. Yeah, he does look like an oni. He's an oni. Bearer of memory. What do you do for a living? I bear memory. You are already dead. Oh, nice. Oh, crap. Oh, nice. What does that do? That's a Omaiwa Shinderu. What? From, a, from a Fist of the North Star. Oh. That's what this is. You are already dead. That's what he says. So swift and sharp was his blade that the ogre never even felt the cut. <laughs> This is an instant destroy target creature that was dealt damage this turn. Draw a card. Oh, nice. So if you slap them for like one, one. and they're like, mm -hmm, and then you're like, smack. There you go. Omaiwa Shinderu. Omaiwa Shinderu. Unstoppable Ogre. Also known as Unstoppable Oni. <laughs> Toma never met a door he didn't hate. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I like that. All right. That's pretty hilarious. Peerless actually. samurai. He looks more like a traditional uh, ogre. No, he looks like an oni. I'm sorry. Human samurai. Peerless samurai, sorry. Okiba salvage. I don't peer. Let's see, Okiba. Hmm. Some fool would rather throw a whole mech away than repair one hydraulic actuator? It must be my lucky day. Nice. Colossal Sky Turtle. Yes. Nice. Would you like a ride on my Colossal Sky Turtle? <laughs> Is that a song that I should know? <laughs> Would you like a ride on my Colossal Sky Turtle? Era of Enlightenment. Ooh. And we get Hand of Enlightenment. Very nice. March of Reckless Joy is our rare. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm I love Reckless Joy. Yeah, it's good. It's like Reckless Love, Wet Sloppy Kisses and all. Wow. Wow. 
Yes. Hashtag Taco Bell. <laughs> reckless love. I know about reckless love. My husband brought me Taco Bell. Moon Snare Prototype is our hollow or our foil card. Foil. <laughs> and then we get, oh look, Quest for the Holy Relic. So this has another card in there that doesn't belong to... I don't, is that supposed to happen? I don't know. I don't think it's supposed to happen. I really don't. This is, but this one's not a rare Planeswalker. No, it's nothing. That's really weird. Does it have a date on there? Does this, are they all dated 19? See, these say 2022. This says 1993 to 2009. Wizards of the Coast. That's weird. I'm telling you, it's an old deck. Yeah, these all say 2022 Wizards of the Coast. So these all have a... What is going on? I don't know. I feel like every pack is a discovery. Yeah, this is not Kamigawa stuff. I don't know what one this is. I don't know. We'll have to look it up. All wow. right, guys. We'll We're do... just getting random cards. Random cards. Random. We're going to do one more pack, and we'll end the video with this pack. And, and we'll just call it a night. We're going to call it a night, and maybe we'll do it another one later tonight. Because we, yeah. we got to eat. Again. <laughs> That's how it always is. Oh. Well, by the time I'm done cooking, we're going to be like, yeah, we'll be I'm hungry. ready to eat again. We'll be hungry. Yeah. That's true. That's true. So tonight we're having Oops. a meal that my mom used to make when we were poorer. It's Spam and Yams. I'll take a picture of it. I've never had Spam and Yams, so mm -hmm. this will be a new experience for me. I'll take a picture of it and we'll drop it in the... Ooh, look at that. I will in a minute. He's like a sky serpent. Very cool. Serpent in the sky, round and round. That would be um, a dragon. A dragon, a dragon. I think. Yeah. A dragon. A dragon. It uh, is a dragon. Como se dice dragon in Japanese? Uh, I believe Ryu. Ryu? Ryu, I believe, is a word that can be interpreted as dragon. Uh, but there <laughs> you go. Wow. <laughs> How pretty are these? They are really pretty. I do like the land cards. Are you gonna start playing with me online? Now that you can get those cool cards like this? Maybe I'll start playing. You can start getting these awesome cards. Maybe I'll start playing online. Alright, Futurist Operative! Well, that's fancy. That is fancy. What do you do for a living? I operate the in the future! Jukai Trainee. Trainee. Mm -hmm. Ju Jukai Trainee. Jukai. Mm -hmm. Jukai. Mm -hmm. Okay. My Japanese pronunciation is spot on! Aki Ember Keeper. What do you do for a living? I keep embers. <laughs> follow me! Oh, follow my lantern, little ones, he says. What is an Aki? That sounds really familiar. Like, I should know that. What is he? I mean, he kind of looks like a cat. But doesn't that word sound familiar? Aki? Like it's a name or something. I don't know. I don't know. You start to pick things up when your wife watches a lot of anime. Aki Warpaints. See? Again with the Aki. Well, let me look at this. Let me look closely. I can't really see what's going on in some of these cards, to be honest. To be perfectly honest. So, like, is that an Aki dude? I don't know. An Aki dude? <laughs> Kindled Fury. See, do you see what's going on in that one? I don't really know what's going on. You got that big beast behind him. Yeah. Aki. I think it's like a demon of some sort. Uh, I don't know. Okay, Kindled Fury. <laughs> Discover <laughs> the impossible. Talk about talk about. <laughs> well, you know we had to get one more in there. <laughs> Uh, Discover the Impossible sounds like it should be on the Oprah book list, too. Yeah, that's true. Oh, my goodness. I've discovered the impossible. She thought you were me. Look at, look at. Oh, 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 I told you she thought you were me. Okay, Come okay. here. This is our old girl. Oh, oh, there she goes. That's our old girl, Gypsy. 19. 
ideas. Okay, Essence Capture. Tales of Master Seshiro. Seen that one. Seshiro's Living Legacy. Yes, we did see that one. Invoke the Ancients. We've had, we have a few invocations. Mm -hmm. okay, I might invoke the, you might invoke the Ancients for an example after a bout with Taco Bell. I certainly hope not. <laughs> oh, I see you, Jeff. All right, there you go. <laughs> A Ganjo Uprising. That's another rare. We got two rares in that one. Is that one also? Also what? Is that one? I'm just making sure. Oh now. no, it's a Kamigawa. Okay. okay. <laughs> I'm like, I'm starting it's to make sure. Stamp, like, I know. Good grief. I'm looking. Br oh, I said briefing. <laughs> Befriending <laughs> the moths. Briefing. And... Ooh. It's oh, shiny. it's a shiny one. Imperial moth. Nice. Are they is it shiny on both sides? Yeah. Oh no. Nice. Double shine. Nice. Double shine, double shine. Very cool. What and is the list? One in four set boosters contain a card handpicked from magic history. Oh. That's it. Okay. Oh. Man, I was getting like, what's going on? But I think we still got a really cool card. No, we definitely got a cool one with that playing yeah. for sure. There we go. So, mystery. So it's like they have extra cards laying around. Yeah. Literally. Because those are actually... Not like reprints, I don't right. think, uh, I based no on the date. I guess, yeah. 2009 is definitely not anywhere near 2020 or 2021 or 2022. She's being silly. She's one of our Pokemon <laughs> plushies. Yeah, Pokemon She's an animated plushie. Po Pokemon plushie. All right, guys. Well, that's all we're going to do for this video because it's getting pretty long. We got stacks more to go. Although I still have half a couple. And we're going to start the show. Mm -hmm. Did you want to open a bonus Pokemon card while we're here? We could. Just if you want. random. Yeah, and not mention it and see if anybody comments at the end. Comment at the end. I mean, yeah. comment. If like, you, if they watch it all the way to the if end. If you watch this video all the way to the end. They get to see a bonus Pokemon opening. Okay, do you know what's in Rebel Clash? You told me that you have a stack of them. I do. Because they might contain the Shuckle. The? The shuckle. elusive Shuckle. All right, I guess my nephew looking. pulled a nice chuckle. He did a reverse hollow chuckle. <sighs> jelly, jelly, so, jelly. What was his? I can't. He, I think he told me, but what was his? Uh, vivid voltage. Vi vivid voltage. He yeah. Pulled that one from vivid. vivid but it's like voltage. old school art. It's like Gen two art. Is it? Yeah, the artwork was like older artwork. Interesting. Yeah, it was really cool. So let's see. Bonus. Bonus. At if you end. watch to the end. The. The, what are they going to do? Okay, the secret word, if you watch to the <laughs> okay, end, secret word, yes. is spam in n, n yams. Spam and yams. So if you watch to the end, comment spam in n yams. yams. Spam and yams. <laughs> Here we go, guys. Here we go. We're looking for a shuckle. Uh, shuckle, the rarest of the Come cards. On. Shuckle. Oh, I'm Shuckle. We can do it. We can do it, Shuckle. You opened it upside down. Now they're okay. all going to know what card that was. No, let me get that out of the way. Oh, nobody should have seen that. Hopefully, no. don't go very slow and look it up. No, I did it off screen. I pulled out the cold card because mm. I pulled a card for me. Um, okay, are you going to guess the energy? I would tell you that Mountain. this... Mountain. Oh, okay. Wrong cards. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want to say? Nobody says mountain. They just say red. Oh, okay. I mean, you're technically right. Okay. But that's All right, not what do you usually guess? what you say. What do you want to guess? Um, I'm going to say water. Dark. I was so close! You were very close. Because dark is the closest thing you can get. But doesn't that look like a demon's eye? The dark symbol. Look at it. I guess. Looks like the pupil. Are we in all, devil's eye. Are we all gonna be like? No, but I think we need to rethink the whole the pocket monster thing, the trope. Okay, here we go. <laughs> would Jack Hiles approve? No, he wouldn't. <laughs> Jack Hiles would be like, what? Training is court, lampant, lampant, Medicham. Medicham. Galarian meowth. What is a Galarian meowth? Surskit. Magic Hey, it's something I know. Meditite. Rakan. Milkery. 
Oh, I don't think we're gonna get a shuckle. I'm pretty sure. That's Heracross right. and a Trevenant. I knew one of those cards. I knew one. I knew one. Sorry, no shuckle. I definitely don't know my Pokemon like I used to. <laughs> there's like a thousand of them. <laughs> it's like SCPs, but Pokemon. I think there's almost as many Pokemon as there is episodes of One Piece. Let me ask you this. Are there as many Pokemon as there are SCPs? Because we're Probably not in the six not. thousands. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. Well. No. All right, guys. Well. That's that. I Remember, that's if you watched all the way to the end of this video. Comment. Comment. Don't say, oh, Pokemon were really cute. Oh, I'm glad we got to see that bonus opening. Mm -hmm. Nice polls. None of that. Mm -hmm. We want to see. We want to see the code word, but don't say the code word right now. Because what if they like go all right. the way to this we wanna point? We want to see the code word that we started saying like back before <laughs> the special opening that that's you right. would have missed if you hadn't watched that's right all the way through to the end that's right that's right all right guys so remember no cussing no fussing and no back talking and if you get a shuckle <laughs> uh -huh. i want to see them yes so post to the facebook page facebook page and instagram you can tag us on instagram, instagram. too mm -hmm. i yeah. kept his tag yeah that's his pokeball that's his Pokeball. <laughs> That's his it's stand. a 2D Pokeball. All right, guys. Well, thank you so much for watching. Like, subscribe to the channel, and we'll see you next time. Hopefully soon, because I really want to get through those Kamigawa cards. Bye. Guten Tag.